Being an artist is a choice. A big part of being an artist is loneliness. We walk around constantly studying the world, wondering how we mix this color and that color. Try to talk with others about your art and you'll get polite smiles and cloudy eyes as you slowly lose them. How would you like to talk, listen, and learn about art for hours and hours over a four-day period? Well, that's exactly what I did at the Portrait Society of America's Conference in Atlantic City. It's four amazing days that inspired me rocked my art world. After I registered, I walked into the main ballroom to find dozens of artists painting live models and being watched by a bunch of the conference members. Then you sneak into the merchandise room. Oh, that was fun. One of my favorite types of paint is Michael Harding and I looked over it was Michael Harding himself. What? And of course I had to get a handful of rosemary brushes. The jury competition was intense. You should have seen these pieces in person. They were amazing. I was quite inspired. Paintings, drawings, sculptures everything. They were so beautiful. And then came the lectures, the demonstrations, and the classes. The staff was absolutely amazing. These are only a handful of the teachers and lecturers that we had. Each and every one of them were approachable and so of course I approached them. All super nice. Even the chairman of the Portrait Society gave a demonstration. He was so nice. And you know, he even did a selfie with me. Check out that mustache. Even one of my all-time favorites, Kwong Ho, gave me some time alone just to chat. It was so cool. Even our local DC artist, Robert Liberace, had a lot to give us. Classes were full of information, just so inspired the entire time. Some wild characters and others were just down to earth. This is Andrew Wyatt's granddaughter. She gave a lecture about her grandfather. Amazing. I walked around a corner and poof, there was a pop-up model session going on. Everybody was scrambling to go get their supplies. Of course, we had to fill up on our creative juices. You know, the paparazzi, they're all over the place. And with the greatest artists of the entire convention. Deborah Kears and Nora Dempsey, representing Virginia and Texas. They're here with me right now. She used to be my friend, she stole one. <laughs> We're Texans. Yeah, Texans stay together. And guess what? This next year, it's in Washington, D.C. I can't 